We're in the playoffs. Um, last year, if I'm not mistaken, we were in the same spot, but on a seventh seed. So we've come a we've come a very very long way. I have decided, at least for this first episode, we are doing two quarters per game. And if you're new around here, the re the reason we're doing that is because if I played every quarter, we would win every game. And I want this to be somewhat of a challenge. So we're going against the Minnesota Timberwolves. We did a preview of that at the end of last episode. I'm excited about this matchup. As you can probably imagine, I will be playing quarter one. Oh, here's the caveat. I have to pick before the game what quarters I'm playing. So I can't hit SimCast and realize, oh snap, I need to jump in at the third. I have to decide before. So with that being said, I'm going first quarter and I'm going fourth quarter. All right, we cannot pick the same two quarters in the next game. Because I think it makes the most sense. I'm going to play first quarter, fourth quarter. When it matters the most, when it first started, then it matters the most when the balls are done. We can't do the same pairing every game. Are we good? Okay, those are the criteria. Here's our first round matchup. I feel pretty confident um, that we're going to win this one. We have them beat in every single category. They were one of the worst defensive teams in the league. Now, the offense is really solid, but they were one of the worst defensive teams in the league. We have the best, better point guard, shooter guard, small forward, power forward, and a tight at the center position. So, I feel great. Let's get into it. And since this is our first home game, our first game as the, the top seed, one of the top seeds in the playoffs, we rocking black. And y'all not. Y'all not rocking this color. Hold on. Can I pick y'all colors? I can't. All right, y'all can wear white. I know you're not really supposed to do that, but I want to black out in our first official playoff game as the two seed. Did I not pick the color black? Did or did I not pick the color black? They were under 500, y'all. Come on, man. Come on, man. We going, where the brooms at? You feel me? I want the people to bring the brooms out to game number. Game number four will be in their place. So they wouldn't bring brooms out to see their home team get swept, but they got decent. Listen. Listen, I know Sacktown fans are primarily in Sacramento for sure, but I feel like we have a super fun team here, meaning that the people across the globe have become attached to what we have created. Look at this fandom here, y'all. Look at the fans in the playoff, man. Sacramento, we changed, we changed everything about us. Everybody believes something because of that man, Coach Timmy Weaver. Oh, they do got us in our black. Wish it was a blackout, but it's a, it's a purple out, so we'll take that too. Who are we focusing our emphasis on? I don't really know. May, I guess it's Anthony Edwards, but maybe not. Do I like you know what I'm saying? Cats got a hard matchup to score on Bim. That is for sure. Harrison Barnes gonna try to showcase that we shouldn't have traded him. I'm happy that we did. You know what I'm saying? D'Angelo Russell, three seconds ago. You gotta do something. You gotta do something. Good defense, De'Aaron. Ain't good board. Now we running. Now we running. Who are they gonna pick up on? Wrong decision. Wrong. Right, this you that's good. That's good rotations for sure. For sure. I don't know much about Jaden McDaniels in this year. I can he can he score better? Oh, good defense, bam. Now we really gone. Last time was a fluke. We find our 46% three-point shooter, Green Bean Machine. It is um uh Green Release Reese. Somebody said that in the comment section of the last video. Green Release Reese. I'm not saying it's the greatest nickname of all time, but it's definitely not the worst. We might use it again down the line. Oh, yeah, they might score zero points this game. We got all this clamped up. We got all... Oh. Uh, we're playing on a really hard difficulty, if I have not mentioned that in this episode. So, yeah, they're they going to score a bunch. they for sure going to score a bunch. And we don't use De'Aaron Fox's mid-range shot as much as we should. In real life, he used that midi more than he be getting to the basket at this point. And we don't really do that in this game. And you know what? I feel solid here. We don't even need no help. That's Carl Anthony Towns, but... Yeah, look at those arms. He forgot that Mikael Bridges got some of the longest arms in the entire NBA. Harrison Barnes, don't do that to your, oh, bam, I thought Bam's gonna come over and get that, get that, uh, get that help block, but we good, see, I need to try, use this time to try to grow a lead, good, thank you, Jeremy, because I was selling, I was selling, now, De'Aaron, not the, not the greatest of defenders, we, I think we kind of realized that, um, but thank you, we, thankfully, we got some of the best help defenders in the entire league, Jeremy, Grant, Bam, Adebayo, Mikhail Bridges, we good, and Tyrese Halliburton gets a big time hammer, five quick points for Reese, what a breakout season for our boy, man. 16 points per game, almost 50, 40, 90. His overall is already up to an 87, and you're no good finish. And year number three? Yeah, this is year number three. Actually, De'Aaron Fox's perimeter defense is an A-plus in this game. It doesn't feel like it when I'm, like, using him to guard. What, what happened here? What? What? Don't foul. Don't even foul. Let him have it. We have lost our first lead of the game. Mikhail, thank you. See, see, people see me get around that corner and immediately think that we're trying to get downhill and dunk. But we also trying to get other people involved. Mikael Bridges in the corner? That's about as open of a shot as possible. That's 
Uh huh. What we doing? Okay. Okay. I'm liking this one. Set your feet, Kenny. Knock down the shot. Tyrese. Tyrese might be our best player. Do you remember early in the se series? I was struggling to even score with bro. And now he's getting pinned down, double screens. He Give me that, boy. Oh, good finish. He's like our primary scorer at this point. Now, that is an arc. What are we, 26, 27 episodes in? That's an arc. Compare, compare Tyrese's game now to when we first started this series and see how much it has changed. He made the right decision. But it's an early release. Rebound, bam. We're gone. I see you, Tyrese. I see you. Beat him down court then. Step back. I didn't exp I was trying to go towards the rim and he went backwards, but we get the tip in from Jeremy Grant. Thank you. Quick lead, baby. We need to pile on. We got four minutes. We only got four minutes left of this playtime, and then we come back in in the fourth quarter. All right, we got this entire platoon second unit for both teams. Not the smartest thing from these coaches, but they got to do what they got to do. Good rebound, Cam. Uh, oh, yeah. This is um, what we call it. Um, the Three Musketeers. Is that what we said? Oh, D. Vincent, dunk on him. He did not, but he finished. Good defense right there. And Cam with another great rebound. I see you, Malik. Why they ain't pick you up? The midi is green. They didn't do the animation. Usually when you hit a green release, they do the animation. Nine point lead. We setting our boys up perfectly. This is game one. Two seven matchup. Steal. Oh, I thought he was throwing the pass. Dean got us. Rebound. Maxi Kleber's on the team. That's a that's a solid pickup. I like Maxi Kleber. Especially in this game, his jump shot is so sweet. Coming across, Davion. Am I going to know your jump shot? The answer is no, but it's it, it was okay enough. The answer was definitely no, though. They're not even really running a backup point guard. They got Noel in as the backup one. Interesting. Good defense. Shemezi! I see you. I see you, Cam. They don't know that you a bona fide shooter. Bona fide shooter. It don't got to be green to make it go down. Block that, Dean. I fouled him. Why did I think a guy that was shooting that bad of a looking jump shot? His name is Chandler. Let, let's go look at Chandler. Power forward. He's a 35% three-point shooter. So he's an okay three-point shooter. One point above average for his position. So we we would have lived if he took and hit that shot. Look at the clamps. Do you really not have a backup point guard? Or I guess Jalen Noel's secondary position is backup point guard. But like, look at his stats. He's below average for a shooting guard so you want him to run your backup point guard he below average for a shooting guard and a lot of those criterias and he's going against mr off night davion mitchell who already has four assists and he's been in the game for like two minutes we can switch that davion there's not a player on this court that i feel like davion cannot guard legit look at that he did he, he guarded everybody that possession that was that was a master class davion go ahead and turn the ball over i guess i wanted to get you an easy bucket but whatever look at the defense from the team bro we got clampers around here. That wasn't even a guy that is known for his defense. Davion, good finish, big big fella. I was gonna call you little man, but nah, you got you strong out there. That's that's my big bro. Another Clamp Master Supreme right here and Herb Jones. Former first overall pick where? Former first over good finish. God, that that was nasty. <laughs> that was nasty. Hey, man, you deserve that one for sure. I thought we played great defense, but sometimes great offense beats uh, great defense. So last possession of the quarter, Malik Beasley. Off the double, that's a green release. 15% contested. Knock it off, baby. 30 to 18, exactly the way we expected it to go. Herb is there. I hope he was. And that's great. That's great. 12-point lead after one. And now we we go simcast for the next two quarters and hope that they don't blow the lead. But if they do, I'll jump in. All right, here comes our simcast. And, well, we gave them a good chunk of a lead, but it, it didn't really matter. We're going into the fourth quarter, only up by two. Second quarter, they, they beat us by 11. We came back just a little bit in that third. We gave up 44 points in a quarter. That is unacceptable for our team, man. We have too many talented defenders to be giving up 44 points in a whole quarter. I love this play. The little handoff. We could pop that three, but why would I when I could just get downhill? That is 17 4 4 for De'Aaron Fox. That's big. Bam has a double double. Tyrese has 13 5 and 3. And Mikhail has eight and two right now. Okay. Good cut, Jeremy. Good cut, Jeremy. Woo! Hey, man, we let it things fly. As long as the sticks are in my hand, I feel as confident as can be. In order to knock me out of a game or a series, I have to pick the wrong uh, quarters. You know what I'm saying? 
There you go, Reese. Good help. Roll with me, bam. Roll with me, bam. Roll with me, bam. Ah! There you go. Good throw up, Reese. Huh. That's great. That's great. Going crazy on the pick and roll. Getting that steal and turn it into a deuce. Bam. Snatch block, bam. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. Bam. Keep running. Keep running, bam. Keep... I'm trying to make dun -dun 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 highlights and stuff instead of just win the game. My fault. My fault. That's my fault. I just thought, like, me and the homies have used to have this thing. If you get a block in a board, you have to get the bucket real quick so it can be on ESPN. But that time we turned it over. Block board and then nothing. Come on, man. Let's 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 quickly. I'm just curious to see what you're doing out there. Oh, Cat is actually dominating. Oh, that's why they score 44 points in the quarter. It was Carl Anthony Towns. Okay, but in the times we've played, he ain't really been on nothing. So I have to manually be the one guarding Cat. Good to know. Oh, that's a steal. And that's Cat. Good defense, Jeremy. Stay there. Stay stay down. Ah, uh, hey. Shout out to Cat. He might try to make this a series. He flexing on us and stuff. I don't like that. Bam, you gotta get him back. Bam, you gotta get him back. Is it you setting the screen? It's not. It's Jeremy. That's fine. Jeremy. Bam can get him back later in the game. Jeremy with a, with a pop. With a tray. I'm telling you, bro. It just take a little bit for me to get my timing back right. And then I'm unstoppable against the CPU. And I will continue to say against the CPU. Because when it's real people, it's a little bit different story. <laughs> Come on, man. Telegraph pass. Telegraph pass. I smoked the three. Ah, I did, I did not, I did not remember his shot, but that's a charge. Great. You saw the telegraph pass, though. I'll be there, bro. I'll be thinking two steps ahead of a computer. Think about that. This is AI, artificial intelligence playing this game. I'm thinking two steps ahead of them. Where you think you, well, that's Mikhail Bridges. If you don't stop with all the malarkey. <gasps> I thought I had my icons up. I certainly did not. I almost shot that shot, but it ended with a dunk. This is why, this is the, look, let me showcase this play and why 2K AI is disgusting. Um, as you can see, you have this player that is trying to guard someone that isn't even ha up half court. You're doing fine over here. You got a man. This guy has a man. He has a man. This guy is going to try to double the ball instead of protecting for the guy streaking down the court. I don't know if that's 2K or they just saying that McDaniels' basketball defensive IQ is that bad, but that's inexcusable. That's an excuse. Oh, no. Hey, Cat about to have 40 of them things. Look at this. Boom. That's nasty. He's about to have 40. 37. No. Go, go number one other than win the game. Go number two, I guess. Prevent Cat from dropping 40. Because he's going to go into game number two thinking that that's... Oh, good defense. He's going to go into game number two thinking that, oh, if he keep that same energy, they'll end up winning. No, you won't. I don't even want you to even think that you have a chance. So you're not dropping 40. And if you do, everybody got suicides. Y'all don't even get to go home tonight. You got you got suicides after the buzzer. Anthony Edwards didn't shoot the open three. Game broken. Game broken. Good defense, bam. Oh, takeover? Lock takeover for my center? That's a steal. It's all right. D'Angelo Russell is selling. I mean, I know the game is practically over now, but he is selling. And so am I with the late release. He is shooting like, I don't know. Four for 20, maybe? I don't even... He's he's playing terrible. Don't let him score. Thank you, Bam. Like I said, you're not getting your 40. Not on me. All right, I feel confident. I feel confident that we're fine. Jeremy with third... Well, we're going to normalize these minutes. And, well, he's going to end up with 40 once the minutes get normalized. But that's fine. That's fine. We prevented him from dropping 40 when it mattered the most. When it was us guarding him rather than the, CP, other than the CPU. This is the final box score. Nope, that's not us. That's, I'm like, that did not feel familiar to me at all. Here's the final box score. Jeremy Grant ended up with 37 after it was said and done. Bam ended up with 16, 22, 4, and 5. Which you like, dang, Bam, you went crazy. But the dude he was guarding had 44. So did you? So did you go crazy or not? Uh, Davion Mitchell off the bench. Now, he shot one for nine. That's not great. But four points, six rebounds, eight assists, two steals in the block from my backup point guard. And yeah, man, that's a that's a very convincing game number one. Convincing game number one. Um, oh, Herb has back spasms. You know what? I you know Herb is one of my boys. I think we're fine to not have him in the rotation for the playoff run. Jeremy just dropped 37 in the playoff game. I would rather Jeremy get a, more minutes. And then 
throw these to Mikhail. It's the playoffs. You know what I'm saying? It's the playoffs and you need to shorten your rotation. So, and I completely fumbled that. Um, that just happened so fast that I missed the entire second quarter. All right. Um, so I guess I'm going third quarter, fourth quarter. We got a lot to make up. All right. So we are down by more points than I can even do the math of. And we got 20 minutes to come back. 20 minutes of solid gameplay. No, no messing around, trying to meme and try to block board bucket people. Just straight up good basketball to try to erase this because they have a lot of hope right now. Because they probably left game one thinking we can hang with this team. And now in game number two, they were up by about 30 at one point. No. Nuh uh. I, wanna, I legit want a sweep to happen. So I got to. I got to do my part. And that's not my part right there missing that shot. But in time, in time. Good defense though. Come on, run it, run it. It's a three on two. It's a three on two. He made the wrong decision. There you go, bam. He's even struggling. Six points, four rebounds. When, you know what I'm saying? We're in the second half, bam. You got four rebounds as a dude that was top whatever in rebounding this season. I want. I wish I could tell them rapido, rapido on these plays, man. I don't need 10 seconds to be wasted. We're, we're going against the clock. We're going against the, the Timberwolves, but more importantly, we're against the clock right now. And I need to make my shots. Come on, Kenny. I'm doing decent with everybody's jump shot today except for De'Aaron's. That's a good look. Oh, good defense. Come on, we running again. Pull up on him there. There we go, Kenny. There we go. If they go sink, sink so much, you got to be able to hit the shot, De'Aaron. Big bucket right there. Brings it down to an 18-point lead. And this is manageable. This is manageable. Slowly. Slowly pick away at this lead. Thank you. Thank you, Bam. Bam is the best trade we could have possibly done, bro. Because even... I need those. I need those, Mikhail. Thank you. Because even if he's not putting up crazy box score stuff, I know that when I'm controlling him, like when I'm playing the games, he's going to defend the heck out of the paint. And I fouled again. That's only number three on Bam, but like we're giving him free points at the free throw line. Why cut? Why did you cut? Thank you. That's a late. Oh my God. I'm playing so bad, bro. I went from just, that was like two minutes ago last game. I was playing some of the best games of my life. Now I'm making reads late and I'm lading open jump shots with good shooters. Like, come on, bro. I do not want to even this series up going into their home. I came into the series super confident. I would, imagine I lose the series. You know what I'm saying? Same spot and now I'm earlying it. Oh my God, this guy's bad on the sticks. Third quarter. Oh, I thought I was having a terrible third quarter. They are one of 15. If it wasn't for me fouling them three times... What the heck? I swear I feel like I'm playing. I'm getting outplayed, but I guess not. So we have some substitutions. They went with with a uh, four subs. We brought in three. Um, so let's still take advantage because we still good defense. There you go. Because we still got our two of our stars in the game. <laughs> oh my god, man! I'm just I'm just playing so terribly. Good defense. Cam is coming to every game he's been in. And impacted the game positively. So thank you, Cam. Guess we switched. Okay. Get the corner. Get the corner. What what just happened there? I, I'm not even sure. So okay, so they're up top. They do like a, a double screen. Double screens always mess everybody up. So they get the double screen. Bam called out switch. Boom. Bam's got ball handler. Davion Mitchell goes over here. Oh, but he cut. And since and I was I think I was controlling Davion since I wasn't there yet. Malik went to help in the left corner. So that that is on me. That's not even on them. We're still down by 20, unfortunately. I got 13 minutes to try to turn this around. Yeah, D'Angelo Russell was hitting late release jump shots that are contested. And we're in a hole, man. We're definitely in a hole. And this is all because I was not paying attention while simulating. <laughs> if we would have been able to get that quarter that we wanted, second quarter, fourth quarter, they would have not put up 44 points in the quarter. You, you see how they're shooting today. In this quarter since I took over. So they definitely was not about to put up 44 or whatever it was. So it's unfortunate that we're in this position. I still got a quarter left with a little bit of change to make something happen. But it ain't been easy. Thank you, Cam, for another good defensive possession. Davion, good help. What a pass. What a pass. D'Angelo Russell is on some next level playmaking stuff. He is looking like Magic Johnson on this month. What the heck was that? I can't even be mad, bro. That's just that's just good basketball. I got it back. I got it back. But this is not about 
just getting it back. We down by a dub, baby. We got to do more. Switch it back. Yep. Come on. Stay solid, Davion. Good defense. We need that rebound. He's too small. He's too small. He's too small, man. Uh, it's back up to a 23 just like that, bro. Every time I feel like I might be putting in a little bit of a dent, the boys come out and do something. And it's, ironically enough, it, it's D'Angelo Russell, the dude that we was making fun of a little while ago. Momentum's one heck of a thing, man. It is so 100% real in real life and in 2K. It's so real. All right, 10 seconds. Good screen. Oh, my God. I mean, the boy I'm there. 23 pointers. 23 pointer in the fourth. Can we come back? Can we come back? Can we come back? Yeah, I believe it. I believe it. There's got to be a number where I, and I'm not saying this now, but there's got to be a number in the time frame where I decide, ah, it's not worth the effort anymore, you know? We come back and we try to sweep them on their court and take control of the series again. Um, but they say the series does not start until a home team loses. And right now we are down bad. And I can't green, but luckily Mikhail Bridges got that for us. Thank you, Mikhail. That was a big time important shot for us. Hit, hit the shot, momentum shifter, boom, bada bam. We in this, yep, that's beautiful, that's beautiful. We, that's beautiful. They was not ready for the little slip of it, and now it's back to a dub. Come on, momentum shift, bro. I don't know if the crowd going crazy, but in my mind they are. In my mind the crowd is going crazy. We got we got Isaiah Thomas in the game right now? Why is that? J-Mac? And they just get a layup. Nathan Knight, J-Mac, and they, they we need to be dominating this lineup. We need to dominate this lineup. And I don't want to call a timeout because they're probably going to make a change. So we need to dominate this lineup with the people that we have in it right now. So that means that either IT got to take over or something, or I need my boy Reese to do something. Somebody has to take over with this lineup. Ah! Isaiah Thomas with a layup. <laughs> Isaiah Thomas with a layup. Okay, okay. This, this lineup for them stinks. This lineup stinks. Oh, man. Okay, all right. If we don't have this down to a... 14 point lead with four and a half minutes to go. We call it a wrap and we come back next game. This is torture, bro. <laughs> this is this is not the Sacramento Kings team I know. Offensive struggles happen. I'm not used to my boys just giving up points when they shouldn't. You know what I'm saying? That's not we built we built the team for the exact opposite reason. And I early the good shot. I, we built this team for the exact opposite reasons. Think about our team, bro. We built this to be a defensive juggernaut. It's just, it's just what it has not been their day defensively. I can, I would be okay with some mistakes on offense and some missed shots. We can't be giving up 130 points to a team ever, especially not in the playoffs. Uh oh. <laughs> we play it perfectly, get the tip, and it just goes right back into his hands. Boop, and he lays it up. You know what? Y'all can have it, bro. Y'all can have it. Y'all deserve this one, man. Y'all y'all outplayed us 100%. Well, there she have it, folks. The man is doing the airplane mode on us. We don't deserve this. We don't deserve this. That's the game. I had, I had a time, a place, and everything that I needed. Y'all won. <laughs> y'all y'all can have it. Good win. We'll see y'all in, in Minnesota. Jalen Noel off the bench, 20 points in 20 minutes. They just had some elite level scoring tonight, and we did not. Reshot six for 22. We'll be back, though. We'll be back in a few days to go into game number three. I still feel confident in our series, obviously, and um, we will come out victorious.